April is Distracted Driving Awareness Month. Today, the U.S. Secretary of Transportation released some startling numbers about just how dangerous it can be. Our John Gonzalez has the warning issued from this morning's test drive. Good afternoon. We are on a test track this afternoon here in parking lot eight at RFK Stadium being chauffeured around, if you will. And today and only today and only here at this lot, driving and texting is being allowed. Type in WXYZ. It's all part of a demonstration on distracted driving awareness month, a driving demonstration. And as you can see, for our driver heaven, it has been quite a challenge. Within seconds, she has run over a couple of cones as she tries to text and read some of the text she's receiving. Police jurisdictions from all over the area are starting to aggressively ticket distracted drivers. The Department of Transportation Administrator tells us about 10% of fatal crashes in the country are linked to driving, just like what you're seeing here. I actually thought that I would be able to pay attention to both things at once, but as you see, I, it was really hard for me to do both. We know in 2013, 3,154 lives were lost, at least that number, 424,000 people injured. And one of our vulnerable groups are teens, 244 lives. That's our future. And we're talking about texting and everything else we're doing in cars, not to be driving. Haven't learned exactly why so many have paid so dearly, many with their lives. So this month and beyond, turn on your engine. Turn off your phones. At RFK Stadium, John Gonzalez, ABC 7.